Okay, here's this USB dongle for FR Sky XSR SIM. So this will allow the PC to communicate with the Torrens radio wirelessly. To set it up, we have a button here on the lower side, it's a triangle. And to bind it, we have to hold down that button. So it's a button. So hold it down and then insert it. Okay, now we have two LEDs on the camera is not really visible. The right side is green and the left side is red. Okay, now power on the radio. Let's create a new model. So press the middle button, go down to the fifth one in this case and create model. Okay, now that one is selected. There's a star. Now let's go to the second page from 12 okay and give a name here at the first one so I will call it let's say USB because it's a USB dongle okay exit from there now go up and it has to be on mode D16 now come down to bind so currently two LEDs are constantly on now go to that bind and press that button making a sound and now the red is flashing okay so now you can unplug it and plug it in without pressing any buttons it's still red but now if I exit from here it turned to green so now it's bound we must have the internal radio frequency thing on because there's a wireless connection between the two Okay, now let's get out from there and let's do some other modifications. So for example, here's FPV Freerider. Okay, go here to calibrate controller and it's not working fine. Only the top right portion is working. So if I move it up and down, the first one is moving. But if I move it down, notice it's going back to the top. Go to the menu. Go to the 5th page, 5th out of 12, these 100 numbers we have to modify to 50. So long press, go to edit, come down to this weight, modify it to 50 and offset also to 50. So enter that 100, tilt that line with that 50, ok, go down to offset and set it to 50 also and that will push the line up 50 now get out from here and do the same with all of them I mean long press edit and 50 long press I always forget it edit So all of them here on the fifth page have to be on 50. Okay, and now if I move the stick up and down, the first one is moving correctly. It says center all sticks, so let's put it into the center and press OK. Left stick to the left. Okay, and it says to push it up and OK. This one to the left and OK and to the front and OK. Notice the circle is way too down. I moved scale. OK, now trim it down. Left is OK. Forward is OK. Left, right. Left, right. OK. And now let's play something. So now the radio is connected to the PC wirelessly through that USB dongle. Yes, it's working. Okay, so that's how to connect your Terranis radio to this USB dongle and play FPV Freerider. Now I unplugged it and next time I will plug it in it will be automatically green and it is working also even if I unplugged it, so it was bound already. Now if you turn off your radio and then power it back on, it will talk about that fail safe. So let's fix that one also. So press the menu, 
go to the second page in the page button and go up and here we have fail safe set that one to let's say no pulses and that's it if you don't want that model on your radio anymore then press the middle button first select another model select model and then that goes crazy <laughs> okay and now on that USB now you have delete model yes or no